Hey everybody, and welcome to my N5 series on the SP404 Mark II, where I cover a topic in about five minutes. This is session 9.1, and today I wanted to cover how to import a session and kind of what it means to work with it. So first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna do shift and pad 14 to get to your import and export. And we want to go import from SD card. I've already exported this project, and I'll upload it so you guys can do whatever you want with it. But uh, you know, use your value knob to go down to project. I'm getting a folder error. So what I need to do here is hit roll and just kind of scroll to pick a different project. I'll be just uploading this as pa uh, project five. Uh, five. So just select, you highlight it and you select it. I'm just going to go overwrite what I had on project five. Uh, but you can select it. It's going red because it's just it's letting you know which one you selected, but it wasn't. It's not flashing because this is indicating that there's already something there. So if you get an empty one, you'll see it flashing. If you need to make an empty one, you'll want to go through and do some backups and stuff. But anyway, with that set uh, to taking Project Five into or loading the folder Project Five onto Pad Five Project Pad Five. Just hit enter. It's going to ask you if you sure you want to do this because you're going to clearly overwrite stuff. Select OK if that's what you want to do. And just wait a little bit. It's going to load up all of your samples. So as you can see here, again, I've got some uh, different samples I've set up with some mute groups and things. Um, whoops. On uh, A lot of this was I was just recording some drums and things and just double tap and get to get back. So I got... You can see I got stuff from uh, A, B, bank A, B, C, D, and E. So a lot of these on the bottom are just drums. And then I, I created a few mute, mute groups. Got some pads. Um, we might end up recording in a few more sounds, but... This was just coming off of like the iPad and some uh, pedals and stuff. I just wanted to record some different sounds in. So as I said, I kind of feel like this might go into, I don't know, <laughs> kind of sounds like a, a little bit of a boom bap kind of kits here, but I don't know. We'll, just, we'll end up making whatever we think makes sense. So as I said, I just want to show you guys how to import. So just to do this one more time, hold shift. Pad 14, go to import. You'll do import from SD card. You'll have already had to have put the content on the SD card. Um, and again, I don't know why it keeps doing this uh, folder error, but I, I find that if I, a, it won't let you even select a destination pad. Um, if you hit roll, you can change whichever folder you want. I'm just curious if I do pad three. All right, if I do project three, it does select it. Um, I don't know why it's doing that, but apparently that's part of the workflow. <laughs> so, again, I'll just exit out of here. Shift, pad 14, import from the SD card, select project, hit roll to select whichever project you want to load. In this case, it's called project 5. Um, and then just select the pad you want to load it to. I'm doing pad uh, 5. Push in your data wheel, select OK, and it will load. So if you guys are looking for how to import projects, hopefully this will help you out. And as I said, I will upload this to my website and put a link in the description. So take it easy, guys, and have a good one. Bye-bye.